Hey, what's up everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Project Ozone 3. So today, <coughs> oh boy, today we're gonna we're gonna go to the Nether, I think. Um, right. So here's what we're gonna need to do. We're gonna, we're gonna build a Nether portal. Um, I don't actually know if Nether portals work in this because. Um, in the quest book, you need to use another cake and also a uh, a an overworld cake. So I don't know if this is gonna work. Uh, hopefully it does because I kind of want it to. Okay, good. It looks like it works. Um, so we'll do the cakes later, I guess, for the quests anyway. But we're just gonna use another portal because cakes are a real pain to make, and I need two of them because I need to use normal cake for the crafting recipe and then a and then yeah make that for the cake this is taking a little while to load um, how are we in a slime biome I one day in the nether right well here's what I want from the nether I literally just need a bit of netherrack um, for some sh sifting um, I don't know how much I'll need so I'll just grab a whole bunch of it maybe about a stack what's this redstone I can iron it. Iron? I can mine it, apparently. Cool. Um, what's this? Copper? We don't really need copper. I also want some heat sand, uh, so that if we ever need to uh, smelt more... Okay, we only need one. If we ever need to smelt more lava, heat sand is really good for it. Um, let's have a look at, around some ores here, actually, then. Now that we're here, we need cobalt to mine that. Prosperity ore. That's what we need. We need these prosperity shards. We, we, I guess we won't be needing the netherrack after all because we've got this. This is what I came for, basically. Um, get, guess let's uh, hand that in. I think it's in Delta here. Yes. What I want to do is I want to start doing some of the seeds and stuff because that's obviously going to be fun. So let's claim that. Um, so what can we do? Base essence seed. Um, I don't really understand how this works. Um, so we can make the essence seeds here like Inferium and the tiers of it. Uh, we can make, we get the essence which we can upgrade using these infusion stones and looks like there's ingots of it as well. So these base essence seeds, what do we do? Um, base essence seed. Can I find it? And now I can't. What about base seed? Yeah, there we go. Um, so we need pros four prosperity shards and one seed for each one of those. Ah. Uh, well, uh, okay, so we're gonna need to get a lot of this then because from this we can make everything else. So we're gonna need to get a whole bunch of these seeds in. So I guess I'll just have a look around the nether here, try not to die, and I'll probably bring back a whole bunch of netherrack with me as well then. So if I do need more, then I can get more. Yeah. Okay, so we're back from the nether. I only stayed for a little bit because I got overrun by some blaze, but it looks like we also found some in inferior essence there, um, some ore for that, so we got that now. Um, next is this Prudentium essence, then Intermedium, Superium, Supremium, Insanium, Creative essence. All right, so. Um, Yes, what we'll probably want is we all we'll want to start with a whole bunch of seeds. Um, unfortunately, I only got 15 shards, and I wanted at least four seeds. So I guess I'll smelt, not smelt. I'll I'll uh, sift through a bit of netherrack here real quick, and uh, we'll see if we can get just a little bit more from it. Uh, we only need one more, really. So let's hope this works quickly. We do also get a few other ores, like ruby, ardite, and this kind of stuff, which is good as well. We need that. Um, and 
if we can get this set up today, that would be pretty cool because these essence things will be really useful in the long run. Uh, looks like we didn't get anything. I'll just carry on here for a bit, I guess. All right, so I've got a few seeds here, so we can make four of these base crafting seeds. So we got quest done. That's great. Let's claim it, and let's see what we can do next. We need we can make the Inferium crafting seeds. Is that the same as... Yeah, that's tier 1. Okay, so it's the same thing, basically, I think. So, I'll just make one for now, in case it isn't. Just in case. Okay. No, these are different things. That's Inferium Seeds, and these are tier 1 Crafting Seeds. Okay, so how do we make Inferium Seeds? Um, no. Oh, that's tier 5. Uh, tier 1. Oh, I see, I see. So to make just Inferium, we don't actually need these, but to make other things we do need these base crafting seeds. Okay, that, that makes a lot of sense actually. So let's just, okay, we've got a whole bunch of these. Uh, what can we make from them now? Um, we can make wood seeds, we can make water, ice, zombie, dirt, nat nature, and stone. Nature seeds I think will be useful. Zombie, I don't know. Dirt might be useful. Wood could be useful. Uh, let's let's make a nature seed, I guess. Uh, that would be the most useful. Tier 2 crafting seeds I don't know how to make. I think I'm going to need to get this stuff. So I would need to get Inferium stones. Infusion stones. Um, okay. Okay, okay. Uh, so... Nature, yes. How do you make a nature seed? Uh, nature seeds. Okay, we need inferior Essence and Nature Clusters. Which are wheat, sugarcane, cactus, and pumpkins. Okay, let's not make that now. <laughs> okay. Um, what else can we make? Stone seeds, maybe? Uh, we have infinite stone. Zombie seeds, uh, zombie seeds. I think we probably might need rotten flesh for that. Zombie seeds. Zombie chunks, which are made from tier 1 mob chunks. Which is made from a zombie chunk. What? Okay. That doesn't make sense. This mod pack sometimes doesn't make sense at all. Okay. I don't really need any of these though, do I? I mean, what does dirt seeds? What what could a dirt seed do? Let's just search seed and see if we can find it here. Dirt seeds. Literally just some dirt. Uh, I'll actually make that because we do need dirt. Um, and we, ooh, we can get quite a lot actually. Uh, yeah, you know, dirt will be useful to us. So I'll get dirt. Gravel especially, that's going to be good. We need gravel, I think, for later. Um, clay, okay, that is awesome. You know what, we're going to make water essence seeds. Uh, how do you make those? Just water buckets, okay. Yeah, we're going to make dirt and water essence seeds. Only one of each for now though, uh, because obviously I'm poor. Uh, so I'm going to need a few more dirt things, so let me just get those on the way. Um, okay, I got some wheat planted here so we can get more normal seeds, because those are fairly rare. You can only get those from dirt, but if I have wheat, then I guess I won't need it. I mean, if I'm, if I'm about to get like infinite dirt, then I won't need this seed, so I'm just going to make a, a normal Inferium seed for planting. Um, so we can plant that there, and that's another achievement done, we can get that. Um, tier 2, what, what will tier 2 need? Um, it will need, as I said, this, yeah, cool, which we can get with an infusion stone. Okay, yeah, 
this is this is like one of my favorite things in like all of Minecraft mod packs. Just these seed things, they're so fun to play with. Especially when you like get into the higher tiers. Need more dirt. I need two more. Come on. Two more. Um we'll also need some iron, so let me hammer some of that. We're gonna need a whole whole bunch of buckets. Um Okay, I only I already have a bucket in here, so it's cool. Uh, let's fill it up with water, and I think it was just something like this. There we go. We've got water seeds. Oh, we keep the bucket. That's awesome. Okay, that's another one complete. Play in that. And we'll make the dirt seeds because clay is gonna be so much so so needed for some of the other advancements or achievements. Uh, for example, here I'm gonna need a whole lot of clay for like Tinker's stuff basically. And it can be a real pain to get, so Okay, what well, dirt, we need dirt, yes, as I said already many times. Put that in. Uh, I guess we can plant this now. Um, ideally, I'll ha I would have separate separate growing things for just Inferium and some for special seeds, but for now this should be fine. Um, we can make one more seed, which will be the dirt one, so that's cool. Let's make that right now. Just like so. Dirt, there we go. Awesome. Can claim that. How much rack do we have? We have 50. Cool. And we need 60 for this? Yes, we need 60 for that. So if we can just find something that's like 10 more, then that would be great. Um, what is this wood seed? Um, dirt, wood, wood. It's just wood, okay. Um, what can we get from this? We can make, oh, we can actually, that could be useful, you know. You can make every type of wood from this, and every type of sapling, by the looks of it. Yeah, you know what? Wood will be pro will be quite useful probably. So let me just wait for the inferior to grow. Actually, you know what? Watering cans. What about watering cans? Um, where are they? Aota? Yes. How do we make an inferior watering can? Um, watering can. We can, make an, we can make a tiny progressions one, um, or we can do these, uh, ooh, ooh, yeah, I don't think we, we're going to be making that right now. What about a normal watering can? <laughs> it needs an inferior watering can, great. Okay, so, uh, yes, we won't be making a watering can then. Um, how can we make this grow faster? Because I'm pretty sure bone meal does not work on this, and also we don't we don't have bone meal anyway. I'm gonna need to make a mob system sometime soon. I, like in in Project Zone two, I made made a mob system on like episode two or three or something like that. Like I made it as soon as I could basically, and that really helped us. But yeah, I mean it's growing fairly fast. It's forty two percent already, which I can just wait for, I guess. Um, it's not like we'll die if I wait for it. So yeah, I th what I'm going to need to do is I'm going to need to make a bunch of chests for just this. Um, let's make let's make two double chests and let's place let's place them right here. So we're going to put all of this in here and. Yeah, that's pretty much it. I have two because I know this one will fill up eventually. Um, and yeah, that's all cool. Um, I think that'll be the end of the episode now, though. Um, did a few, we did a few quests here. I don't think I'll be able to get any more rack today. Um, not for a little while, though. At least um, we can get five if we wait for that to grow. Um, but yeah, 
also um there's a mod called modular machines um and so you make you basically make a big machine sort of thing i think from all of this it's kind of like big reactors and then you can have these machine blueprints and guess what there is an auto sieve so that is what we're going to need to make at some point uh you, you can basically do everything that you used to be able to do with the auto sieves um in project ozone 2 and sky factory 2 and 3 and all, all that so yeah we're going to need to make that at some point but not right now obviously and yeah so and the episode so uh thanks for watching hope you enjoyed be sure to leave a like subscribe if you want to see more and hit that notification bell to miss not miss anything else yeah um missing my words today so yes thanks for watching have a good day bye bye